So the next section of the need assessment checklist that we're going to do now is entitled psychological health and we're interested in how people think and feel because we know that's obviously kind of interconnected with what we do. Sure. So it's an important part of um, rehab and uh, there's a few different questions I'll be asking you okay. um, but if there's any questions as we go along just ask for clarity. Fine, thank you. So um, the first uh, questionnaire is thinking about how you felt over the last two weeks. Um, so I'll be asking you about how you felt and your options for answering range from not at all, several days over the last two weeks, more than half the days over the last two weeks or nearly every day okay. over the last two weeks. Um, so the first question, for example, it says, have you felt little interest or pleasure doing, in things, doing things? Do you say that's not at all, several days, more than half the days or nearly every day? Um, I think several days actually. Okay. Thank you. And so the next one, the feeling down, depressed or hopeless. Is that something you felt not at all, several days, more than half the days or nearly every day? Um, it's difficult to say for two weeks, but over the last two weeks I, it has been several days. Okay. Thank you. Um, trouble falling asleep or staying asleep? That is a problem. Okay. Uh, so I would say more than half the days. Okay. And is that trouble falling asleep, staying asleep, or both? Falling asleep, both actually. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I'll just make a note of that. Um, feeling tired or having little energy. Is that something you felt not at all? Several days in the last two weeks, more than half or nearly every. I think several days, but it depends what I've been doing, okay. uh, what activities I've been doing, but yeah. definitely several days I, I have okay. felt uh, uh, tired. Okay. Um, poor appetite or overeating? Not a problem for me. Okay, <laughs> great. So I'd say not at all? Not at all. Okay, so I'll put that there. Um, feeling bad about yourself or that you're a failure or have let yourself or your family down? Is that sort of feeling you've had not at all? several days in the last couple of weeks, more than half the days or nearly every day? Um, several days again, I think. There have been moments when I have started to doubt myself. Okay, yeah, thank you. Um, trouble concentrating on things such as reading a newspaper or watching television? No, that hasn't been a problem at all for me. Uh, I enjoy reading and watching TV as a reputation, okay. so uh, I've been able to concentrate on that fully. Okay, great, thank you. So I'm going to put not at all yeah, for that. that's okay. fine. Um, moving or speaking so slowly that other people could have noticed um, or the opposite being so fidgety or restless that you've been moving around a lot more than usual it's fair to say, sometimes I do feel like that yeah. um, I can't really understand why okay but there have been moments and people have men mentioned it to me as well okay and is so that be the sort of more slowly or the sort of the fidgety uh, slowly I think okay yeah. so Okay, so I can, I'll make sense of that. So it's definitely a two, I think. Okay, several days yeah. over the last couple of weeks. Okay, thank you. And the last one of this section, thoughts that you would be better off dead or of hurting yourself in some way? Hmm. That's, that's quite a searching question. Yes, um, yeah. It'd be wrong of me to say that it hasn't happened. Okay. But it doesn't happen, thankfully, too frequently. So okay. I think really it has happened on several days in the last two weeks, okay. unfortunately, yeah. for me. Thank you. Thank you for being open in your responses because it's just helpful to get a sense of where Thank things you. are now. Um, in terms of those kind of thoughts you just mentioned, can you tell, is it thoughts about harming yourself or? Well, I think a lot of it depends on how I've been feeling on the day. I've had some yeah. bad days yeah. and I've had bad days. I sometimes sort of reflect badly on them and I, th I think sometimes, why has this happened to me? And, uh, okay. yeah. and I think also, oh, I wish it, I hadn't sort of recovered or just, just stayed as yes. I were. And, yeah. and uh, I've never thought anything that I'd do myself any harm. Okay. Um, yeah. But there have been days where I really feel, why me? Okay, yeah, no, that makes sense. And I suppose it's one of the questions here because it's not unusual those to be right. feelings that might sometimes go through people's minds and I suppose what's worth just keeping in context while you're here is that it sounds like at the moment they're not thoughts that are leading you to want to take any action in relation to that but if that changes or if you feel the intensity of it does start to increase and it becomes more of a common 
thought mm -hmm. and feeling that you have, then I'd definitely say please do share it with someone in the team that you feel comfortable to share that with, mm -hmm. because there's absolutely kind of support available there from the team. Yeah, that, that's the good thing about being here, yeah, yeah. is that whilst I'm in this environment, there are people I can talk to if that happens. Yes, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. So, yes. That's great. I appreciate it.